You know, I never thought I'd have a career in fitness. My first job out of college was in pharmaceutical sales, but pushing pills just didn't feel right. I realized I wanted to prevent people from having to take drugs in the first place. So I decided I'd become a coach. And now, I love what I do. All five moves in this full body workout are what are known as self-limiting exercises. That's a technical way of saying you literally cannot cheat. Take this movement for example. You're primarily targeting your glutes and quadriceps, but because you're also using your upper body and abs to stabilize, you're essentially hitting every major muscle group. Be sure to keep your chest up and your shoulder blades back and down on this one. By performing a deadlift with a glider like this, or with a towel under your foot, you're using your whole body to coordinate the movement. Even the muscles in your feet and ankles are contracting here. Be sure to keep a tall spine throughout the lift and don't lean too far forward. Think about your torso and your leg moving as one unit. This version of a kettlebell press is a great building block for lifting large amounts of weight overhead. It will give you the proper strength in your forearms, torso, and shoulders. You will not be able to push this weight overhead if you are not doing it properly. I personally like this movement because you cannot compensate with other secondary muscles. Although it looks like a back exercise, and don't get me wrong, it does target your posterior chain, the bent over row is also a six pack maker. Your oblique muscles have to fire to keep the torso from rotating. Again, keep a tall spine and be careful not to round the lower back. This will ensure your abs are engaged. Even this chest press will target the abdominals as well as your pectorals. Doing the press on the floor means you cannot overextend. This minimizes the risk of shoulder injury. Be sure to drive your shoulder blades into the ground here. That's what powers the press overhead. Even when life's busy, in fact, especially when life's busy, it's so beneficial for your mind as well as your body to exercise each day. It's not about having time, it's about making time.